Hey guys, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are at in this world, in whatever time zone you are in. I hope that you are in the best of health and everything. So, I'm going to try out this primer. So, I'm going to wipe off some of the oil. It's already on my face. Okay, I'm back. So, once I feel like my nose is dry, then I'll be able to put on the primer. I got a lot of discoloration in my face, but it's okay. So, I'm going to put on a little bit. That might be enough, I think. This is how much I have in my hands, and I'm going to just apply it on my nose. Okay, so I got more, and I'm going to apply it to my other porous areas, which would be right here. Okay guys, as you can see now, my face is looking really, really dried out and really dry in my T-zone area. That's about the only spot that I applied the primer to is, you know, my nose and a little bit of my pore area and a little bit up here. So now I'm going to apply my MAC Studio Fix Fluids and I think this is, um, my color is NW55. Excuse me, I had an itch on my nose. NW55, so you guys can see the primer is, is dry and it's just really, really dry. So now I'm going to apply my NW55 um, foundation and this is from Mock, Mock, Mock. I'm going to pump some onto my hand and then I'm going to put it on my face. This pump ain't working right. Oh my God, I haven't used it in a while. Mm -mm. Okay, I think it's open now. Okay, it's open now. So this is the full coverage um, foundation in NW55. And this foundation dries really, really fast. So here we go. I'm just patting in with my e.l.f. brush. And as you guys can probably see and tell now, this is definitely a, um, a full coverage foundation. This is actually my first full coverage foundation I ever tried. And I actually do like it and I think it's a great color match for my skin. So that's one side. Now I'm going to do the other side. To the other side. Dries pretty fast. And this is actually my first demo of using this foundation and I do like it but it's not a foundation that I will wear like every day or whatever. Now I'm going to take a little bit on my forehead area. And some down the bridge. Let me see how it's going to do with the beauty blender. Use something different. Matter of fact, I better just stick to my brush. Since I already started with the brush, I might as well stick to it, right? Right, 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 right. Do I think I need another coat? No, not really. And this again is the e.l.f. brush that, um, guys, so that's how it's looking on my face. I love the foundation. I think it looks beautiful on me. I think it's a perfect color match. This is actually a color match that, um, I got from, what's that girl's name? 
um make it happen mo i would say i'm this kind of same complexion as she is so so now i'm going to add some powder over it i'm going to be using this pow tall the mac Miller life skin finish in dark deep and i had this since 2012. <laughs> that shows you how much i so i'm just gonna pat that in pat it in pat it in Pat it in, pat it in, push it, 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 push So this foundation is a full coverage foundation and yes it did cover up all of my imperfections the little black dots i got on my face i think it pretty much covered that and i pretty much use almost like one layer i use probably the second layer a little bit under my eye area but i think it covered pretty well i could have used a second coat but like i said i like my stuff light i don't like anything heavy on my face i don't like that feeling in the winter all right guys i'm back and as you can tell i have to take off the scrub off my lips and wipe it away okay this is the wet and wild liquid cat suit lipstick and give me mocha I can't see it but give me mocha 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 so while that's drying I'm going to put on my blush and my mirror is over here so I'm actually looking over here I need a mirror in front of me but that's kind of hard to prop up a camera and then do a mirror at the same time but I can use my my um camera mirror so here we go I'm using the black radiance blush and toasted almond which is beautiful 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 what is up with this weather it's like windy out there like crazy yes it is what a ear what a ear what a ear y'all what a what a ear y'all it's a pretty blush it's so pretty and natural and soft you know you know so <laughs> can y'all see that blush can y'all see what i'm saying Right, guys well here's my makeup my little makeup tutorial is done i think it looks pretty cute i don't really do much with eyeshadow i don't like doing with eyeshadow it's too time consuming so i mean maybe one day i will but so i'm going to spray the nyx matte finish um setting spray on my face it is a matte um setting spray so we're going to see how Mm. let that dry my foundation is pretty much already matte so we're gonna let that dry and see how it's gonna look afterwards got my little hair in a little top knot bun the back is is braided and i kind of just put it up in something got So, let me give you a close-up. Let you guys see what I was working with. 